What is up my shred heads? Welcome back to the channel. On today's live stream, we are finally gonna be unboxing, actually we're gonna be unboxing the, really the smallest e-bike I've ever had on the channel. Like, look at this thing. Like, what the hell? Like, half of the size of the normal boxes that I'm used to. So, this is the Angway Holding Mini e-bike. It's a T14. That's the model number. Uh, before we get started on this video, if you guys do want to support the channel, I do have a link for the Angway T14, I think it's an Amazon link. I should have the geekbuying.com. That's who sent me this bike link up maybe tomorrow, I'm not sure. But if you guys do want to support the channel, check out all those links down below. If this bike isn't for you, check out all those other links down below because it might be a bike you like. Uh, Dee's behind the camera there making a post. Everybody say hi to Dee. Dee say hi to everybody. The mic is just chilling right there on the ground. Hey guys. So who's all in this stream now? I want to say hi to everybody before I get started on this crazy super mini bike unboxing. I'm going to feel awesome on this thing. I'm actually super excited about riding this thing. I cannot wait to bring this thing around. So we have Matt the Mechanic. What up? up? We're just hanging out earlier, bro. Mike Warren going teeny weeny. White mud. Yeah, let's get this. Let's make this a 72 volt. Drop a, yeah, he said drop a 72 volt on that SOV. <laughs> Is that what Mike Mike said? Yeah. <laughs> Great minds think alike. Kimmy TRV. Hi, uh, how you doing? Hi to all from upstate New York. Thank you for joining the channel. And uh, I hope you guys are excited as I am to get this thing out of the box. And I finally, I think I'm gonna be able to lift this out of the box and not have to lean it down like I normally do. Matt, the mechanic said mini super builds. Love right? it. Right? I, I've seen people make like those little Jetson bikes go pretty quick, so maybe we could do something like that with this. Mike Warren, Marv and I have some crazy stuff coming next spring. I can't wait for that bomber of yours, man. That's going to be awesome having that on the channel. Did you get rid of the 72-volt um, the, the X-Class? I know uh, a lot of people were really loving that bike. So if anybody is interested, uh, White Mike is selling a 72-volt X-Class. goes like 50, maybe a little bit faster. Matt McKinnick said another present from Santa. It looks like that, right, guys? It's our treats. It's still up. It's, we're taking this down tomorrow. <laughs> it's staying up till the end of January. Yep. What's everybody up to this week? Are you guys riding any e-bikes? Unfortunately, the rest of the week is going to be horrible for me. So maybe we'll do like Freezing. another live stream. I got a bunch of new uh, stuff to unbox for the Sur on here. I got some giveaways and stuff. So maybe we can do that uh, sometime this week live. That'll be pretty fun. You did take a ride on your bike this morning to Surf Bagel, though. I did, and it, it was, was a lot of fun. Freezing. It was cold and windy. I was doing wheelies, like getting blown sideways. It was hard. I scoop Connecticut. Robert from Hartford, Connecticut here. What's up, Robert? Hope you're having an awesome day. Bry Runster. Hi. What's up? Mike Warren. Hi, D. Hey, White Mike. What's up? Piotr Menka. Hello from Poland. Holy moly, that's awesome. What time is it in Poland? What's up from Delaware? Bry Ronster said, can I have one? That's a possibility. Maybe yeah. we'll do a giveaway with this thing. <laughs> yeah, he just had a folding e-bike giveaway yeah, actually, for Christmas. We, we just gave away, what was it, the JC on folding e-bike. Bry Ronster said hello from California. Cali, nice. what's up? I can't wait to go there again. I'll be going there pretty soon, man. i got to hang out with Shav, and there's a few people i got to catch up with over there. Mike Bourne said, I still have not sold it. Kimmy RV said, my sister would love it. Dude, this would be awesome for RV rides and camping and just taking out all over the place. That would be amazing. And just so you guys know, I think we're going to be doing some, uh, some group rides. I was talking about it today, maybe from the Exxon here in Dewey Beach. We're going to try to do something where uh, we ride with e-bikes and regular bikes and kind of do that thing where you like light up your bikes and ride around. Think about doing something like that this summer. There's also a group ride in Tampa. So it's like another Suron mega ride going on like March first through the third or something. I'll be definitely going to that. I'm not sure if I'll be bringing my Suron or if I'm going to be borrowing somebody's Suron down there. There's also, uh, man, there's more stuff going on. There's like a huge ride in Chicago I might try to make it out to. There's a, another mega ride in New York sometime in June or July. But once all that information gets out, I'll, I'll be sure to share it with you guys so you guys know where all the rides are. I know a lot of people always hit me up like, where do you find out about these rides? Just got to be on the internet looking, join some groups and stuff. And follow Shardy <laughs> on Instagram. And follow me. I'll definitely tell you all the rides I'll be at. So um, that, that's Shardy, super excited. I'm posting a link to this bike. So where is it from? Uh, this, this one's from geekbuying.com, uh, I think it's called. But uh, you can get it from Amazon. I did put the link down there. 
Um, if you guys see in the chat, uh, the, the chat's right over there. Um, so you can always answer right there too. Um, there's, you can do polls. So if you guys want to do any polls, uh, let us know what kind of poll you want us to throw up. Like what's your favorite e-bike for this year or something like that. Um, any questions, Dee? Nope, that's no it. Oh, oh yeah, we I mean, we have a lot of comments. These, so you can start making a post things. right now, so <laughs> she's not paying any attention to Let's you guys. Let's see. Um, Poland. Okay, Rye Ronster said. That's a cool name. Do you like the Suron? <laughs> Do I like the Suron? <laughs> Is that a trick question? <laughs> I love my Suron. Bry, have you checked out his check out his uh, what is the video? The Houston Mega Ride? Oh, the Mega Ride video, yeah. But uh, I do have some pretty awesome upgrades coming for the Suron here. I'm going to pretty much have a brand new Suron after all these upgrades are installed. But I'll, I'll do like an unboxing live and kind of talk about all the different parts, what they do, what's it going to do. Uh, if you guys are interested in anything on the channel, if you see any e-bikes or you're interested, they're always, there's always a discount link down below. If not a discount link, there is a link that um, actually tells the company that I'm the one that sent you there. And it does help. So far on this video, there is one link for this bike, but all of his other videos have all of his discount links for like the Suron, oh, Suron upgrades. Whoopsie, sorry guys. I'll throw, I'll throw the links oh, on there really that, quick uh, after, after we're done the video. Any questions? Should I get started on this okay, sucker? Get started. All right, here we go. Mike Warren said it's cold and rainy here in Baltimore. Oh, it's raining already? It's, it's just cold here. It's so cold far. and we got a wind warning. I guess we're going to get like 50 mile an hour wind gusts or something. I want crazy. it to snow. All right, it's got staples. As you guys know, I hate these freaking staples, bro. They always get me. I hate the staples. What the hell? Do they... A kilt? Is there a freaking kilt? Oh, no, I don't know. What? <laughs> what? 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 It's not a skirt, Eddie. <laughs> is this one of those like horse feed bags or something? What is this? It's like when Shreddy's rolling down the road and he's like hungry, he puts some food up in there. Like, oh, maybe it's a little front basket or something. I don't even know. What the hell? Oh, yeah, look. It's a Velcro. Don't tell me that it has a little freaking basket. That's hilarious. Yeah, I'm sure that like wraps around something. <laughs> oh, it's got Velcro here too. Are these like saddlebags or something? Get out of here. I thought they gave me a kilt at first. I'm like, oh, wear this. All right, <laughs> All right I'm gonna get this little <laughs> Anybody making fun of me about the, the kilt? Oh, here we go. All right, so every time you guys open these, just be careful, these freaking staples, man. I'd rather them glue them than staple them any day. I school Connecticut said, I hope Shreddy does not spill his water. <laughs> I hope so too. Actually, you know what? You just scared me. I'm gonna move this. No, it's on a table. It's good. It's good. Are you sure? I feel last, like I'm gonna. It was on the floor I'm gonna last pick the, time. Oh, that's right. I feel like I'm gonna pick the bike up and swing it around. It's gonna go. All right. All right. That's right. You guys caught. If you didn't catch that, the last unboxing, I freaking knocked over a glass of water there, and we had to stop the stream and get everything cleaned up. All right. Charger. My guess is it's probably a two to a three amp charger. I'm not sure if this is a 48 volt or a 36 volt, but it will tell me here in the cha charger. So it is a 48 volt e-bike. I'm pretty sure it's got a 350 watt motor. My guess is that the top speed on this should be around like 15 miles an hour. It looks like it's an XLR charger. I'll just get the connection on there. So that's a charger connector there for it. Earl Buckley said, what's good, Shreddy? I finally got my Lyric Graffiti. Oh, bro, how are you liking it, man? I'm waiting for mine. I'm trying to get on one. Uh, Shreddy has a discount link for the Lyric Graffiti also. I'll put his discount links for all the bikes um, in this video. Give me a second. Yep. Is there any polls you can think of? Like, would you rather have a mini bike, <laughs> a regular like moped style bike, or a high powered bike? What's your style of riding? All right, I'll start a pull. What's your style of riding? Okay, so we got our pedals here. I'll just put everything off to the side. Keep everything nice and together. Whoa, does, is this like a 20? Yo, if this has a 20 amp hour battery, I'd be so surprised, but it looks pretty big, bro. What? Okay. We'll get that out here in a second. All right, we got, hell yeah, you know, Got that notification bell, some tools. Uh, bro, 
you guys know I'm not going to read the instruction manual on this, and I've never built one of these little mini e-bikes, so it might turn into a struggling with Shreddy, and you guys are going to probably have to help me get the build totally finished out. My this guess is mini e-bike always be happens. Easy, I would think. Dude, maybe I'm going to lay it down and slide it out, I think. I don't know. Huh. If I moon you guys, I'm so sorry. Oh, Shreddy's shirt also, you guys, can purchase. It should be listed in the merch area on YouTube. What's going on here? Look at these little tires, dude. What? Get out of here, dude. That's awesome. Kickstand. It's so cute. <laughs> Get out of here. It's like a little baby. He looks pretty cushiony. Holy crap. Look how fat this seat is. Bro. Uh-oh. Instruction manual. What should we do, guys? Look at that seat. <laughs> that's her big, that's a big booty seat right there. Let's see. That's ready, got a, a big booty. That's good, okay. right? <laughs> that looks funny. <laughs> it's funny because there's a pole sticking up there. <laughs> She's like, all right, all right, <laughs> enough of that. All right, so it's got a nice little forward tilt on it, unless it's angled backwards. Yep, it's got a nice little back angle on it. All right, <laughs> almost knocked over D's water. <laughs> so that was a close call. I do have another bike right here next to me that I can pull out. Once I get this thing completely built, we can uh, let's see what the size difference is from a normal style moped e-bike to the little mini baby moped e-bike. Look at this thing, dude. What? You know, I've always wanted a little mini bike. And this is it. I got it. <laughs> Yo. The first thing I'm going to do is sit back here and try to wheelie on it. <laughs> what do you guys think? You, Thumbs up if you think I could wheelie this thing. That's so weird. Check this out. So here's the plug, I'm guessing, from the controller, which is back here. I can't see how many amps it is, though. And it's, it's almost like that old uh, method mechanic. Remember that old uh, e-bike that we worked on from the 90s? It's pretty much like that. Like it has a down tube or uh, the battery you slide in like that, and then you plug this in. To the bike, I've never actually had seen newer style bikes like this before. Pretty, pretty different. different. Dude, look. Oh, wow. See, look, it's got wheel covers on it. Oh, that's oh, nice. That. So, if you live in an oh, apartment or something, yeah. you want the, uh, dirty tires on the like, floor, you yeah. can always keep these and slap, slide them back on or whatever. That's great. Yeah. Because then, yeah, it doesn't mess up your floor. It doesn't mess up, like, if you have to put it in your trunk or, yeah, the, it doesn't make, leave, like, black scuff marks. That's awesome. Oh, the only thing is with these ones, you got to cut them because they put it on before they put the tire on. Oh. If it had, like, a little <laughs> zipper or a Velcro thing, that'd be great. But that is kind of cool. That is kind of cool. But somebody needs to make that. We're trying to get my mom to sew up some. Yeah, because we got some bikes inside the house that... We don't want them touching the ground. All right, now we're getting everything off. Any questions of, uh, about anything? You guys, we have, we have a lot of comments. If I don't get to any, if you want me to read your comment right away, feel free to send a super chat. Yeah, the super chat pushes your comment right to the top. So we're not trying to skip your comments on purpose or anything. We try to get, we literally try to get to every comment. Sometimes these streams get packed with people. Alec K said, can't wait. Alec, what's up, brother? I can't wait to get my freaking uh, EUC, man, and ride with you and the crew. Lighted Crafts said hi from California, Boricua. What's up, Ike, Boricua, wepa. Hell yeah. Mike Warren, Assateague camping trip. I love Assateague. I think we should do some kind of long range ride, bring our chargers. Uh, math and just freaking rip. Math and Mechanic said Mike is dropping signal. Do you want to use mine? Your microphone? My microphone? Yeah. It it's, it's probably just right now. Can you guys hear his microphone okay? I scoop Connecticut. Is the guitar restrung yet? <laughs> no, dude. I was actually talking about that today and I was like, I was just jamming on the uh, top three. Well, you know the, the bottom strings are called the top. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, I need a, I need a new, new whole set of strings. I'll get that fixed up soon, but... Bro, I've been fiending to play music in some bands. I'm really missing 
some band action. What about if we can get to like 50 likes, go play a song? I, I can't. It's broken. <laughs> there's there's a broken string. I can only play that, that one. Matter. It's not too happy to eat tall water. Dude, look. It's got freaking to, what? It's got suspension on the rear and right here in the middle. What the hell? It's like your favorite bike. <laughs> Dude, it's got like dual rear suspension, like the freaking, like the Grizzly. <laughs> What the hell? Guys, Wow. this bike is silly. I love it. Handlebars, right? Yeah, handlebars. I'll plug in the battery last in case something, something crazy happens. Dude, what? Chang, Changfa. Changfa. That's what it says on the suspension. Changfa. Oh, it's got a full twist throttle. Let's go. <laughs> That's awesome. Hell yeah. I dig that. I dig it. All right. Before I start putting everything on, I want to completely naked. Get off. Oh, here's that little side suspension. Look at that. What the hell, dude? They make these little bikes freaking suspension. It's Bro. like a little mini motorbike. Is that a direct drive hub motor? Electric motorbike. Does it say it's a direct drive? It looks like a direct drive hub, but I really don't know. I'm gonna have to get the specs on this thing. Mechanical disc brakes, of course, of course. Dude, a freaking full twist throttle. That's so cool. I love that. All right, so everything's pretty loose. So is this like a mini electric motorbike? Oh Dude. no, I was thinking that was the back seat, like a motorbike, but that's not the seat. <laughs> okay, so this goes up. I'm guessing this somehow goes down like that and locks. Doesn't seem like it like locks for crazy. Maybe I should look at the, the instructions just in case. Any questions? Any questions? Or do you got, you got the pull up? What's going on? Whoa. Let's make it super mini at first, and then we'll raise everything up. Oh, it's got, guys, it has two sets of keys. So it does have a little ignition here. So then I kind of wish it didn't have two sets of keys. Uh, that's more to look, or that's more things that you can lose, but, so you got a little ignition, and then you got the key to remove the battery here, the charging port, does it have a, like a USB charge for your phone or anything, maybe on the battery, I don't think so, no, so this is a 10 amp hour battery, I wonder how heavy it is, let me, let me pull that battery off. All right, I just updated all the like discount codes and links in the video description. Yeah, guys, check them out. All right, uh, let's go back to some comments. Oh, wow, look. Oh, my God, this thing is light. 10 amp hour battery. <laughs> I feel, there's probably a way to upgrade this and maybe get another battery like this, a little bit bigger. Dude, there's definitely a way to get more more, uh, more battery in this bad boy. I'm telling you, there's got to be. Uh, Piotr Men. Mendeek, sorry if I'm saying that wrong. Um, Shreddy, tell me please, what is the real range of the Zeus 1100? I, I think I've done a range test, bro. You might have to go back and look at the videos. I can't really remember the exact mileage I, I got on that thing. I don't even know if I've done like a full, full throttle range test, but I know I've done uh, range tests on that battery before for sure. So check out the Zeus 1100 range test on Shreddy's channel. And just so you guys know, I do have the OG 1100. Uh, I think right now they're up to like a V2, maybe a V3 now with the, the uh, bikes that have color and then the, a little light on the front, different connection points for um, uh, like racks on the front and the rear. But if you guys are interested in the Zoos, I don't know if you even said that, Shreddy 220 save $150 off that order. Um, okay, so next I'm going to put the seat on then I'm going to tighten Eddie, up. Eddie, change mics with me. Everyone's saying. Your I'm mic cutting out. Up. Yeah. Really? Hold on. It could be this. Hold on. 
I don't think it's it's the mic. It's probably the uh, technical difficulties, guys. Yeah, sorry, guys. What do you think it is? Can you drop me? Can you guys hear me on this? I'm just grabbing another. Uh, it could be I, I use these mic these uh, road wireless mics, and then from riding the the cables kind of bend a lot and. I probably mess it up. Are they are are they giving me a thumbs up? They can hear me. Can you guys hear me better with with it like this? Yes, they said much better. Okay. So okay. So now I know I got to buy another one of these. Unfortunately. Thank you guys. Thanks guys. I'm sorry. Sorry I was cutting out. All right. I'm gonna plug in this mic and then let me know if it's still working. It's not a struggling with shreddy video unless we're struggling with shreddy, right? <laughs> Okay, everyone's saying perfect. Check, check. How about now? Are we good? Check, check. Marvelous. Still good? Okay. Sorry, guys. So I'll have to mark. I'll have to <laughs> no mark. No worries. Glad we got through. <laughs> What's that? He said, no worries. Glad we got through it. That's funny. Whew, we did it. Started sweating there. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's back up to some comments. Uh, we're going to try to get caught up on some comments while I figure out how to tighten this down a little bit. Get my... Uh, Get my brakes nice and lined up good. Oh, where uh, is Back to the Zeus 1100. Is a possible 40 mile, 40 mile range normal, not full power ride? If you're pedaling or just like throttling easy, I'm sure you can get 40 miles on, on that uh, 20 amp hour battery on the 1100 for sure. Charlie A said, hello, Shreddy. What's up, Charlie? How you doing, brother? Scoot Connecticut, snow in Connecticut tomorrow. I know I'm jealous. We haven't had snow all freaking year, but I'm saying that now and I'm, we're probably gonna get like a, the craziest snowfall right before spring hits. War said, come on warm weather. But the one thing about uh, snow, I do want snow here. Why? I have these V tires that have these freaking, uh, what are they called? Uh, like nails popping out of them or whatever, studded. They're studded freaking tires for the e-bike. Front and rear, and guess what bike I'm gonna put them on? Guys, comment, what bike am I gonna put studded 20 by four inch tires on? What do you think? Which bike am I, am I gonna do that on? Hmm. And I can't wait, that's gonna be fun. I think I'd be able to ride like on ice too with those. Maybe take them on the ponds and stuff. <laughs> that would be pretty fun. I'll give you guys like 30 seconds and I'll, I'll answer. She just said the bag that came with a bike looks like a Burberry bag. I know. Where's that supposed to go? You just reminded me. <laughs> Kimmy, like, TRVing. I have electric 1.0. My guess is like. Do you like it, Kimmy? Like that. Which is, uh, I know they have elect. One of the electrics has like a mid drive motor and dual battery and stuff. Does it hang from the handlebars, Eddie? Well, we like got like these you? things on the side too. I don't know. Because we got Velcro things on the side. Maybe it could be like side What about side? we open up the instruction book? <laughs> what, what is that? <laughs> what, what is that? I think it faces you. I think it goes like this. <laughs> I don't freaking know. All right. Maybe oh, we'll Brian pull the instructions McCann. to see where that goes. Brian McCann sent a 99 cent super chat of a hey. poop emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, it's still man. steaming. <laughs> <laughs> that was a line from one of my last videos where we went to the um, Christmas parade and like the, the horse, horses were like pooping all over the place and there was like a big freaking dump. I was like, oh my God, it's still steaming. <laughs> all right, let's get these keys off of there. All right, got two sets of keys. Dude, we got suspension and it's not even, dude, wait a second, what, hold on. I'm finding more and more about this little bike as I look at it. So, all right, I didn't tighten that down. So we got, bro, it's got front fork suspension. It's got, I don't even know what to call this, middle crotch suspension, I have no idea. And then you got the dual back <laughs> suspension. <laughs> what the hell? Dude, this is like, like a top of the line bike if it was like a big, big bike with all that stuff on it. <laughs> this bike is actually like 400 bucks or something on Amazon, which is not bad at all. That's yeah, like under a, 500 guys, yeah, good can't price. Can't beat that. 
All the way down, let's do it. All the way down, little mini bike. Look at that thing. D, you can definitely fit on this. Oh yeah. Bro. This is my kind of Bro. bike. Bro. You fit on it too. This is all, oh, it's so soft. It's so soft. Dude, I'm, I, should I ride it like this? Like the whole review video or should I raise it up? I oh. think it would be oh, hilarious. Oh, you can raise it up? Yeah, so you can, you can raise this. So say you're a little bit taller or, oh, we can't go up that high. <laughs> so like right there. Oh crap. I gotta tighten it up. <laughs> Des Gibbons is on. Des, Des he made on. it! Bro, what the hell happened? I've been waiting for you to get back. Damn, his his account was like locked out or something, or maybe he had something turned off and it wouldn't let you comment. But Des, what do you think about that? Look, it has suspension here, front fork suspension here, and then on the other side too. So it's got Freaking suspension everywhere, dude. That's with the battery. Oh my god. Is it it's, light? Yeah, oh, with look battery. How you are. <laughs> uh, and the battery's pretty dude, did I just Okay, it doesn't have a rear brake light, no. It's got a front it might. front light. Uh 350 watt motor. Alright, I got pedals apart. Dude, I'm so excited. This bike is gonna be fun. <laughs> I feel like it's like Eddie's Christmas morning. <laughs> it kind of does feel like a Christmas now because I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. I can't believe this folds, bro. Oh yeah, and it folds. <sighs> My notification. Oh, we can actually throw this in the car. That's Well, that's perfect. a cool little bell. <laughs> Not too loud. This can go in the trunk or the back seat. Or, or if you guys thing. have a Tesla, it can go in your front. Oh yeah, should, should I fold it? I'll fold it up after I get the pedals on. How about that? Yeah, we'll see how small it looks. No, they didn't give me a wrench to get the pedals on it. Okay. You should have hand. one by now. I do, I do. <laughs> All right, let's see. Still going back. Oh, hold on. I got to make sure it's the R. That's the L. iSchool Connecticut said FedEx is bringing me my new e-bike tomorrow at Troxus Links. What is that? I'll have to check that out. Maybe you can slide me a link to that. I'll, I'll definitely want to see what that is. Oh, they said it was like a rubbing mic sound, everyone was saying. Oh, really? Anaconda Hugs is on. Oh, okay, so look, maybe the mic, I gotta test out the mic later now. <laughs> Ice Cube Connecticut said that bike is adorable, dump the Suron. I know, so little, dude, yeah, I might have to take the Suron mid-drive out of there and maybe swap them out. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get back in as quick as possible. I definitely did not grab the right tool that I wanted, but I got it. I got one. I got That's a tool. That's so funny. Super tiny. They were talking about your microphone. He said, sounds fooked. <laughs> sounds fooked. <laughs> Mike Horn, selfless plug for the sweatshirts. Love it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Turn down. Looks like a fun bike. Dude, that's gonna be a fun bike. I can't wait. Oh my God, so many people were commenting about the mic and I didn't even know. I'm sorry guys. I mean, you can only see like three or four comments at a time. <laughs> I got people like leaving like, dude, your, your sound Some sucks. Someone said it's only 350 watt, what that is? Only 350 watt motor right here, but. Well, how fast does that go? I don't know, we're gonna look it up. I don't need to go too fast on this thing. Yeah, I, don't, I probably don't want to go super fast. Todd McDanger, that stinky Philly in the building. What's happening in my evening? What up? Philly in the building. What's up? I'm gonna open that back door a little bit because it's getting hot in here. Matt was trying to call. Yeah, Matt, my phone is always on DND, which means do not disturb oh, when I'm go. live. Ian Tate said, I wonder if he tried any other Angway models like the 1000W Pro? They got a 1000, oh, hold on, wait a minute. Didn't you just review that? Uh, no, not yet, it's downstairs <laughs> in the basement. <laughs> oh, he just did unboxing for that and he's gonna do a review probably like next week. It's gotta get nicer around here. The weather has been caca. Talk McDanger said it's kind of cool looking though. I like it, dude. Like, I, I don't know why I'm so stoked on this little thing, but I am. We're gonna fold it up though once I get this pedal on. We'll fold it up, see what that's all about. This is too big for what I need. Mike Warren looks like Moto Compo from Honda. <laughs> Todd McDanger said his mic is in a bag of chips. Oh, is that what it sounded like? Oh my god, that sucks. So maybe the mic was like rubbing like this. So hopefully that mic is still good. <laughs> Joe OSW. 
Dang, I didn't know we were going to have to take a test when this video started. I would have studied. <laughs> oh, what did I say? What, what bike? Did they ever answer what bike I'm going to... Um... Oh, the, the pole, maybe? The pole, yeah. Super tiny. Clipper 909. One more thing. Um, dumb Waldo, you don't need a battery upgrade because that is going to be so slow. There's no way you can ride it till the battery's dead. <laughs> right. I'm going to have so many miles on that little Holy 10 amp hour battery. It's freezing outside. I know. They start getting cold. Uh, what do I need for deal? Joe OSW. Hey man, that looks like my guild guitar. She's beautiful. This one? This is a, uh, old, old Washburn. I'm actually borrowing it. I'm, I'm going to change the, the strings here soon, but I'm borrowing it. I still have my orange uh, 212 cabinet and I forget what orange head I have and in my, uh, my Kirk Hammett uh, KH602 guitar with a Floyd Rose tremolo. <laughs> so I need a screwdriver for this they bell to put it on. I don't have one right now. So what's that? I said th those guitars are not accessible, unfortunately. I miss playing electric. I haven't touched an electric guitar in three Three years? Literally three years. I've been touching that acoustic guitar most of the time. If you guys can figure out where the heck this goes, maybe it hangs like this. There's no way it hangs towards you, right? Todd McDanger said Mars Rover bike. <laughs> that, yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, that's, you, want, you guys want me to fold it? Let's freaking fold this sucker. So first, I guess, would e you just bike. push that all the way in? Yeah, it's definitely like a mini bike, right? unclamp that. I wonder if there's a way to lock that clamp because it doesn't seem to lock and it does pop up like pretty easy. All right, so you put that down there. Thank you everyone for your help. We also have a new person in Super Chat, Jules B. A lot of you guys are new. What's up, Jules? Thank you guys. If you guys are new to the channel, if you guys are enjoying the content and you're not subscribed, maybe consider subscribing for more fun hangouts like this. The sound was worse than his crying baby. Oh my God. So was it every time I moved? Dude, I don't remember which way this goes, guys. Thank you guys for sticking around. Super tiny said 8K. Guys, I don't know how to take, take this down. Bike looks like great fun. It does. Look how little it is, dude. Todd McDanger said, it looks to me like the pedals will hit the ground around the corners. Oh yeah, definitely. Look how low, look how low we are. So anytime you're turning on something like this, uh, my, some other bikes that I have, their pedals are low too. Keep your pedals like that when you're making turns anytime. I've seen people get taken out like that plenty of times. Okay. But Shreddy can't figure out how to get this part down. Like there's like a so, Brian McCann said struggling with shreddy. Yeah, yeah. struggling with shreddy has started. There we go. Okay. So it does lock. It has a locking mechanism. Pull it off to the side. Okay. We figured it out. <laughs> Mike Warren, the struggle couldn't be more real. The struggle continues. Brian Grady, what's up, Shreddy? What's up, Brian? How you doing, brother? Some water said grizzly. Does this have a lock too? Grizzly. Oh, okay, Eddie. So are these snow tires for the grizzly? Yes, sir. You guys got it. <laughs> Good job, guys. Does this lock too? Yep. Okay. So both of these mechanisms, you got to pull them up. Dude. Yeah, look super how tiny freaking so small. Tires and Grizzly would do all. Yo. Yeah. Look how small this is, D. Wow. Look how small it folds up to you. Bro. Look at that. Get out of here. Bro. You can throw that in your car so easy. Look at that. I'll give a little, a little turn. That in the back for my bag. Hey, how much does it weigh? Dude, I don't even know. I want to say like 50 pounds, if that. Let's get, uh, where's that other phone? I'm going to pull out all the. Well, there's the um, instructions. <laughs> I'm going to go on Amazon and get all the specs on there. I'll get it put together. Let me just find it. So this is the Engway T14 electric bike. It says for adults and teens, but I think people of all ages can enjoy this little thing. 350 watt up to 19.2 miles an hour. They're calling it a fat tire mini bike, but that's a pretty small tire. So we're gonna go in here. 
It says full shock absorb absorption, professional tructure. What's what's a tructure? <laughs> Let me show you guys. I think this structure? is straight, straight from China. Tructure, professional tructure. <laughs> so yeah, it has like all those crazy freaking. Let's open it back up. <laughs> All that crazy suspension everywhere. Like how freaking nuts is this bike? It's freaking crazy. And again, guys, he has a link for this bike in the video description. It's for Amazon right now, but it did come from Geek Buying. And he'll update that link soon, as soon as we get it. So that's good. That, that now knowing that this does lock in two ways, that way, and then you pull it the other way to unlock it. So that's cool. All right. Battery, plug, is there an on and off switch on the battery? No, I don't see any. Joe OSW, I have studs on my 4.8 inch fat tire bike. If you're into ice shanty crawls, it's the only way to fly. Ice shanty crawls, there we go. Dude, I wonder if I can fly with this. Could I take this bike on an airplane? <laughs> That'd be crazy. Definitely if you have like a camp or something, throw it in there. So, oh yeah, I want to take off those things off the tire. So 350 watt front fork, we got the saddle, a center spring, like they said. Anti-lock brake system, but I don't know, it's a mechanical disc brakes. 10 seconds folding fast. 19, again, what I say, 19.2 miles an hour, 350 watt. Uh, 48 volt, 10 amp hour battery. We got the two amp charger with the XLR connectors. Just make sure I'm not missing anything else. 350 watt brushless motor, so it's not a direct drive. It looks like one now, sure does. Run flat tubeless tires. These are tubeless tires, get out of here. So this bike has like tons of awesome features. What? Why is there an air thing though? It says, uh, Dual 14 inch explosion proof vacuum tires, 10 millimeter thick rubber tire, wear resistance and anti-skid thickened and anti-puncture effect greater than four millimeters. Easy to deal with various and bad road conditions. Okay, so that is a rear deflector. It does have the headlight and a rear deflector. Um, where do we turn on the headlight and how? Does it just automatically turn? dude? I, don't even, I haven't even figured out how to turn the bike on yet. <laughs> rear reflector, automatic reflection, lights illuminates the, the race car, the rear car, ensuring your night driving safety, rest assured, night riding. Adjustable shock absorption saddle. This thing is pretty soft though, to tell you the truth. It does feel pretty soft. Any questions, guys? I yes. want to check out these um, tires. Tommy Changer said, transform the grizzly into a polar bear. Dude, I, I, I'm telling you guys, I cannot wait to do that Grizzly video with those studded tires. It's, I think it's gonna be like another level of fun that I have never experienced yet in life, and I cannot wait. Brian McCann said, cute e-bike, Deke can ride this one. <laughs> she can definitely fit on it like this, look at that. Like, hold on, I got a great idea, actually. Did I, ha I have anything else to show them? Oh, let me, let me just rip these off. Joe said maybe it's a hat, that plaid bag. There we go. <laughs> you think it's a hat? <laughs> Super suspended. Um, Let's put it it's on. It's a my Peter head. Dinklage bike. Oh, it's a what? Peter Dinklage bike. Is that what the, this style of bike? Dude, I, I, I'll figure that out later. We'll Surface figure that out later. Sheena said, my Super 73 S2 doesn't even have back suspension. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> this has middle suspension, front, back. <laughs> it's got all the suspension. We got suspension here, there, and everywhere. You get to, oh, hold on, like a double click? Okay, so one click, the light again? is that on? Oh, nice and quiet. Brakes rubbing a little bit. Oh, rear brakes on the left, let's, yo, Shorty's gonna wheelie this thing, let's go. Show us the light again. So one click turns it on, two clicks turns on the front light. Not super bright, I'll probably put some. It something. was nice and bright when you shined towards the couch. Yeah. Nah, it's. I got other headlights or lights I'll put on there, like my night motion lights. Oh, like a flashlight? Light and motion, not night and motion, yeah. If you guys are interested, I do have links for that too. I think they're Amazon links. Dude, hold on. Does it have a speedometer? No. 
their display only has like has like some dots, like three dots and then a red dot. But hey guys, always make sure when you guys get your bike put together, charge that battery first. Don't do what I just did, but I'll just make sure everything works. That's crazy. The tire looks like it's like weighted all weird, a little bit shaky, but my Super 73's done that since the beginning. Should I give it a little, little go? Can I go? <laughs> Yay, it's so small you can ride in the house. I'm out. Yay. Whoa. <laughs> Bro, this thing's got like a little bit of good torque. It's fun. Yo, I want to, dude, I'm taking this to, uh, I'm taking it to the Home Depot and we're riding this through and I'm going shopping. <laughs> See ya. Dude, that's a lot of fun. I like this bike. I like it. <laughs> Shorty trying to wheelie already. Any comments? It looks Any so comments? It's fun. We can ride around the house. Yo, I'm going to wheelie this. Does it have a uh, brake disconnect? Yep. So the disconnect is somewhere around here. I'll disconnect it. All right, let me get uh, the, another bike so you can see the differences in size. Hold on, let me step back and look at this thing. Dude, that, that thing. Freaking, it's like another level of bike. Crazy looking. John Bug says, Shreddy's new wheelie machine. Yep, I'm gonna try. I'm, I'm gonna try to wheelie everything. Every wheelie. Yeah. Said, keep the full light, bright light drains the battery fast. What'd he say? Keep the full light, bright light drains the battery fast. All right. All light is better on this bike. Can you tell like difference in size now? Oh my gosh, guys, look how this looks. <laughs> I wanna step back and look too. Dude. It's like literally, I'll pull forward, ready? And then reveal the mini. Look at that, the difference is crazy. The enforcer said looks just in size. How big is the battery and motor? It's a 10 amp hour battery. It's a 48 volt, 350 watt, uh, what did I say, geared, brushed, brushless motor. Oh look, and it, dude, is that for a passenger? Oh, two people can fit on it. Where were the- I can sit back there. <laughs> Hold on, where's the pegs though? Where would they put their feet? <laughs> Maybe you can slap some pegs on there and like ride like that. I'm probably gonna ride like wheelie like that. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the wheelies would totally work. That's definitely for another passenger. I'm not really sure. Really? Where you could put pegs on. Yeah, because it's soft. It's not like it's like a rack or anything. They Anaconda wouldn't... said, what is the max weight on this e-bike? Oh yeah, what's the capacity? Let's see. And My guess is probably like two people in that thing. <laughs> possibly 300 pounds. Da, 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 da. We should do a video where we try to put two of us on it. I'm not sure I see like a weight capacity on here. They said, how hard is it to pedal? It doesn't have gears, but you want me to try? All right, so the bike is off. Dude, this is going to be hard. Dude, if I knock anything over, it's their fault. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be hard with the, the it's hard with the um, handlebars down that low right now. So let me get it. I remember guys, he will be doing a full review of this bike, so make sure you su subscribe to the channel. Yeah, I wonder what the max capacity on this, weight capacity. Super tiny said, you guys should have kids. They could have a bike. <laughs> every single kid. Every day we have a kid and they'll, they can have a bike. Uh, let me raise this up a little bit because when you're pedaling something like this, you definitely, definitely have to have those legs extended. Anaconda, hold check the weight in one second. Thank you. Oh, I thought he was going to do it for me. Oh. <laughs> I was all thanking him. Thanks, bro. Oh. Thanks for doing my, my work. It should be. Oh, book. yeah, like that? That's easy to pedal it like that. Go, let's go. So, I, do I not have do to put again. air in these tires? But why is there a, a valve? I've never experienced anything like this. Yeah, definitely super easy to pedal, guys. Super easy to pedal. Super light bike. <laughs> Trying to I'm just feeling how solid it feels. <laughs> I mean, it literally feels like every other folding e bike. Dude, the suspension works. <laughs> Let me give you guys some bouncy bounce bounce. <laughs> Any questions while I bounce? 
<laughs> I would like to see this compared to a Jetson because so far what you're telling us, this has like amazing quality. Yeah, it does. Suspension and everything. I cannot and believe, I, I had no clue that it had all that suspension all over the place. So riding this thing's going to be pretty fun and comfortable, guys. Yeah, Mike Warren said it may be small, but it's fierce. It is, dude. I'm going to take this out after we're done this stream and just see how, how it feels and everything. I'm definitely stoked about it. What do you guys think about it? Comment, comment down below. Just let me know. Let me know what you guys think. This They're thing is saying, sick. Uh, Loon said cool bike. Thank you, Loon. What's up, Loon? How you doing, brother? Bulletproof. Ho hope to ride with you soon. Bulletproof said to put a 3,000 watt motor on it. Bulletproof. <laughs> Bro, it would be the whole rear wheel. That'd be crazy. Joe OSW, <laughs> make it a dual motor and throw 1,000 watt up front. Oh, that would be crazy. Dual motor with like dual throttles. <laughs> Damn. Uh, Mark Huff. To unlock, turn off key, hold brake, and open throttle, then turn on bike with brake on. That's to get the full 20. For 30 to 60 seconds, and bike should be unlocked. At 20. Don't forget your helmet. So hold on. Re Repeat. <laughs> <laughs> to unlock, turn off key, turn off hold key. brake, and open throttle, then turn on bike with brake on. And throttle open for 30 to 60 seconds. Really? Okay. So I'm going to make sure that it's uh, not locked first. Just make sure it goes up to 20 miles an hour. If it doesn't, I'm going to try that out and I'll let you know how it works out. Thank you, Mark. That's crazy. Thank you, Mark. I appreciate Del Moto, it. Dude, they are tubeless tires, not airless tires. Oh. They just don't use inner tubes. That's if so crazy. Flat, it's like a car. It. It's like a car. See, so what do you say? Get a flat, you can if plug it? If you get a flat, you can plug it, reinflate the tire, and be on your way. Seriously? That easy? Dude, so this is pretty much like a motorcycle or a car tire then. Why aren't all e-bikes like that, man? I, I can't tell you how many times I've had to take apart the rear whole tire of the hub just to change an inner tube because a nail went through it. It's a lot of work. It would have been so much easier to just plug it and forget it. Yeah, Brian McCann said bring a charger with you on all rides. All the time. Super tiny, check out the unlock. You guys know a lot about this oh, bike. You guys do, that's awesome. David Cook, very cool, I want to ride it. What's up, I dude? Do too. Hell yeah, dude. Todd I can't wait to try it. It's almost a scooter with the seat. <laughs> dude, it's so crazy. It's crazy it has a rear seat too, though. Like, they expect two people to fit on. Hold on, let me get the uh, max weight again. Let me just go to the Eng way. Any in more the building, questions? Mini Me from Austin awesome Powers is going to be calling the police for his oh. e-bike. <laughs> That's so, so true. You, those sell out real fast on Mackinac Island. Has no vehicles and they are allowed. That's nice. So it looks like this is selling for $5.49 on other websites and then $4.99 on Amazon. That's crazy. Super tiny. Get a 60 volt battery too. So this is super suitable for riders between 5'4 and 6 foot 4, but I still think it's smaller than 5'4. You could be probably 4 feet to sit on this Oh, tee. yeah, I'm only 5'2". I don't even know two. why it says that. Motor 350 watt, high think speed brushless. This is definitely good for riders probably like 4 foot 8 and mm -hmm. up. So this can push the, out a max. This is a 350 watt motor, but it uh, pushes 680 watts max. I mean, that could fit like someone that's 4 feet. 6 to 8 hour charging time. Oh, what's the weight? I'm looking, I'm looking. So maximum grade for climbing up hills is 30 degrees. It does have a waterproof level of IP2, so don't get stuck in a downfall. Uh, downpour? Downpour. No, 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 no. Saddle, uh, best tire pressure, KPA 250. I don't know, we do PSI here. I don't know what that means. Joe OSW, you could easily put two of those in an RV. Definitely. Dude, this doesn't oh, tell me like the maximum weight, bro. Come on. Can anybody else find the maximum weight on these things? Des Gibbons said it's like Vern Troyer's speeder bike. Oh, Vern is oh my God. Mimi, right? D, this bike from Angway's website is $629. It's crazy. The prices are kind of like different all over the place. Yep. So we have the lowest price in your link. That's good. Yeah. That's crazy. Bike weight is 31 kilograms. What's that in America? <laughs> Pounds. <laughs> All right, let's go back up to some comments that we skipped over earlier. It doesn't tell me the max, the max carrying weight. I cannot find the max, max weight. We can back both in. get on it, and then it should be like what, two hundred fifty pounds, and we'll see. When the instruction manuals help out. Oh, is this like a something like I put something on in the back? A little shreddy logo on there. 
Any questions? Any questions? Brian McCann said, low, low ride it. You think, you think I should Super do that? Tiny, stand on the seat and ride. Try suspension. Runaway Electric, what's up, Shreddy? What's up, Runaway Electric? How you doing? Hope you're enjoying your day. My Thank you for said, joining the stream. Watch your nuts instead of check your nuts. <laughs> right, watch your nuts. Always watch your nuts. Brian McGrady, it's like one of those circus bikes for bears. It does, dude. I'm, I'm going to feel awesome riding that on the boardwalk. I cannot wait. Atomic, Atomic Danger 100 millimeter crank arms. There's not much, anything on here. It just, it's telling you like the faults. That's crazy. Easy. Yo, the, the crank arms are so low. Look how. <laughs> Definitely watch when you're pedaling this bike. Little battery. Does that tilt forward in case you don't want to? I mean, work? you guys, you could probably definitely even be like three foot ride this bike. I don't know why they said five foot okay. four. So that check this out. That's like, doesn't even make sense. You can leave the seat out to get the battery off. You just do that. It has a little lever right up underneath there. Unlock your battery, pull it out, take it to go charge. Boom, dude. What do you think, Dee? That's cool, right? Love it. It's, it's so cute. I can't wait to ride it. It looks fun. Dude, freaking I want to try tubeless. To ride it with you. Get out of here. All right, so I still got to fill up the tires with air. Let's get pegs for the back and I'll ride on the back. What's the max PSI? ET said, hey, Shreddy, como esta? Como esta, mi amigo? Toy bien, toy bien. David Cook, I mean, the Christmas tree is still up, lol. It, it'll go down soon. Hey, I said something about it today. I was like, we got to take that down. Hey, it's make... our first year having a fake tree. I'm like enjoying it while I can. People are going to make fun of us on the stream. Like, you guys still got a tree up? It looks festive. It's the end of summer. No, I'm just kidding. Joe OSW, if you can get into the controller and change a few things on the set and on it, set the wheel to 24 or 26 inches and you can increase the speed by several miles an hour. So the thing with that I always hear is you're, all you're doing is tricking the controller into thinking it's a different wheel size, but you're not really getting the top speed. So you can always try that and then put it up against uh, GPS, but I'm pretty sure you're, you're, you're just tricking the controller into thinking it's going faster, but it's really not. Mini me e-bike, everyone's saying upgrade it. Dude, I cannot believe how light this is, though. Todd McDanger, that bike will make me look taller. <laughs> <laughs> right? Dude, D would look like a giant on this thing. Minnie Mouse has lost her bike. CA said hi. D can't even fit on this bike, and this thing is low. Uh, Brian McCann, you can upgrade that rear wheel hub for a 2,000-watt motor. That, that same little size? That'd be crazy. 350 watt goes 50 mile an hour tops. Yeah, I can't wait till your first ride in review to see how fast this thing goes. And if I can get it like to wheelie, that'd be crazy. I just got to get the brake disconnect you off. You got to pick me up so I can hop on it in your review. Yeah, you're, you're, yeah you can sit on it backwards. Maybe that, that's easier to ride like that. <laughs> just Do you let, have pegs we can put on the back? Let your feet hang. Like, hee. Dude. You know, it'd be crazy if you could have some kind of like extension thing so you could sit backwards and put your feet on it and just chill. Did I already read this one? Ice Cube Connecticut. When is Shreddy's birthday? He needs a pedal wrench. It is coming uh, February 20th, actually. February 20th. I don't know what we're going to do. I don't know. Are we going to be here? Are we going somewhere? Are we going to Florida? Are we going to come visit you guys and ride with you guys somewhere? I want to do something cool for my birthday. Super tiny, 30 degrees and half past midnight in the UK. Oh, it's 30 degrees there, cold. 39 here and super, we're getting like super Dude, windy. It says 39 here and it feels like it's like negative 39. Oh, did Des ever tell us what happened? Joe OSW, see if you could get an aftermarket sidecar for it. <laughs> Imagine that's like a little mini sidecar for a chihuahua. That'd be funny. Loon said, Shreddy, I made it. Hell yeah, Loon. I can't, dude, I'm going to be, are, are you going to be going to the uh, Mega Ride, the New York Mega Ride? I'm pretty sure you'll be there, right? Brian I'll be there. 10, 10 amp, 350 watt motor. Let's see. Yeah, 10 amp hour, 350 watt motor, uh, 48 volt. Goes up to about, what they say, 19.2 miles an hour, 680 watt peak. For this little thing, Engway T14, I do Joe have a link. OSW, out of the old Fender Jazzmaster tube amp. Is that what he said he has? Did he say I have that? <laughs> I don't know what he said. I don't know. I wish I knew the actual name of the orange head that I have. It was like a, I used to have the Tiny Terror, and then I upgraded to another one. It's like a white head. 
tube, tube, tube head. I forget the name of it though. It's really, it sounds so nice and warm. Brian and McCann said, it's a fun bike. Have you, have you, anybody else ridden a bike this small, like an e-bike? Could you tell me like what it feels like? <laughs> It's gonna feel it's gonna pretty it's gonna feel pretty cool though with the suspension I think. Don Bug said hi Shardy and D. What's up Don? How you doing my brother? I can't stop smiling about this bike like I, I feel like my face hurts from like smiling about I, this it bike. It is like surprisingly really nice. It looks it's like cool, a mini motorbike dude. the way it's like put together like. All right, put my big ass end. on it, dude. Like, what the it's hell? It's not just like cheap plastic. That's so crazy. Like, this, this would be so awesome for camping, RV trips, like uh, husband and wife or whatever combo. Take two of these, fold them up, it won't take up any space. You can even buy extra batteries in case you want to do a little bit long range, maybe even upgrade it, put an extra rack back here, throw another battery here. So a lot of cool things that you can do with this bike. I, I, dude, exciting, exciting. I'm going back, guys. We have more comments than ever tonight. <laughs> Sorry, so guys. If we didn't get to your comment, feel free to send a super chat and we will get to it. Yeah, the only way to get the comment to, this, to the top would be a super chat, but we're trying to get to every single comment. Uh, Joe SW said, take the trip, click that like button. It helps the algorithm. I appreciate it, Everybody Joe. Thank here. you. Um, Math and Mechanics said, this would be a great bike to put in Allison's car to do the review. Oh, yeah, because she has like a small little car. Little small mini little car. Truck. Mini car. Bubba Shitty, what's up, my brother? Dude, uh, we, we were looking at electric bike cars. So it's like a trike and then like a car thing around it. You could probably throw one of these inside that. <laughs> Anaconda Hugs, this bike looks cool. I want to buy one too. You should get one, bro. This thing is sick. Who, who said hi earlier? I saw you waving. Somebody said hi, hi. Bubba Shitty. What's up, Bubba Shitty? In the building. What's going on? Get that instruction manual out oh, of there. Oh, the review channel. I got my nephew this bike. Not bad. It's pretty cool, dude. I, I can't believe I'm so excited over this little mini, like, clown-looking bike, but it's so neat. I and love it. Joe OSW, you can put that in the front seat. Uh, yeah. Brian said, I have the Jetson Bolt Pro. Doesn't hold, though. It doesn't hold? I would love to compare this and the Jetson. Like, I think yeah, put them next to each that. other. Yeah. I feel like this is still this smaller profile than a Jetson. I feel like the Maybe. Jetson looks like um, a cheaper frame. Is Jetson tubeless also? Tubeless tires? Probably like, doesn't have like all the features. I don't know. Headlight, does the Jetson have a headlight? I saw last year, it was in my video, it was two people in a Jetson and then they had like a little trailer with all their beach stuff on it. It was oh, hilarious. Cool. Yeah. So you could probably get like a little trailer put on this thing, go around, get some camping going. The, the motto, maximum lithium battery size to fly is 100 WH. So that's like nothing. That battery is 40. A 480 WH, too big to fly. That sucks. Those damn freaking, what were they? The hoverboards that were catching on fire back in the days? <laughs> damn it. Ruin it for everybody. Actually, now two people are getting really, really bad, crappy batteries sent to them on these bikes. Um, not these bikes, but some, some of the Chinese cheap bikes. Oh, no, that's not good. Yeah. They can start fires and stuff. Yep, 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 yep. The review channel, if you want to fill the tires up, try to lay it on the side of the vehicle. Okay. Super tiny, get a higher voltage battery immediately and it'll go faster. I wonder what, what controller is in this thing, man. I want to know how many amps this controller is pushing. Under and 500 is a great deal, man, especially if you have an RV. Yeah, it's like $499 on, on Amazon right now. But other sites was like $600 I found it for. And, but yeah, I get it from Amazon, $4.99. The other one, the company that sent me this was geekbuying.com. I don't know what the price is actually for them. Let's check. Let's check. Anaconda said, fold it up and bring it on the plane with when you fly to Hawaii. <laughs> Dude, that'd be awesome. I'll have to send my battery like through the mail or something. Um, search. How big is the battery emitter? This is a 48 volt, 10 amp hour battery. And the motor is a 350 watt motor. I think it peaks at 680 watts. So from geekbuying.com, now this bike is 549. So it's still cheaper from Amazon. Amazon link below. Amazon link is in actually the comments and in the description of the video too. 
Joe OSW, it's handy to have an extra set of downhill skis if you ever bopping around frozen pond. If you drink too many, <laughs> wobbly pop, it's really <laughs> easy to fall over. <laughs> wobbly pop. I never heard of that. That's funny. That's Did a you good find one. the max weight on the sea bike? I couldn't find the max weight. I'm, I'm, I'm like literally looking all over the place. I looked on Angway's website. I looked on Amazon. <laughs> Electrical energy, quadruple shock, all terrain, multi scene. <laughs> Brian McCann, they're like, you can't get two, two people on here. Brian McCann said, passenger wraps legs around front driver. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how it works? <laughs> two drunk people only. Des said, tell Shreddy I'm finally back. Had to delete my YouTube updates. Hmm. Huh, really? Oh, he did an update. He couldn't get back in the live chat. So That's so crazy. It was so long. We hit, uh, So Des couldn't get into the chats for so long and I was hitting him up on, on uh, Facebook like, yo, where you been, man? It's like, I can't chat. He thought, like, he thought I may have like blocked him, but definitely did not block you. Ryan McCann said it face. should be about a 250 pound to 300 weight capacity. I'm looking at the questions on Amazon to see if somebody asked that question. What is the maximum weight? The description says 330, but other descriptions say 220. Which one's correct? The, the correct weight limit is 220 pounds. This is not a serious transportation for anyone over that weight. So up to 220 pounds. I think maybe I'm 160 by now. I used to be 150, but winter adds those pounds, as you guys know. Weather shortened wheelbase. I imagine it's extremely maneuverable and would be great in a crowd. Dude, imagine ripping through freaking concert on this thing. Or like a big show, that'd be awesome. Actually, yeah, for like festivals and stuff, bro. Perfect. This would fit in your tent. Someone Perfect. Three hundred thirty pounds. We're seeing two sixty-five, three thirty. Dude, it's so it varies. Like, like nobody really knows. So I guess I'd I'd keep it on the lowest end that they said two twenty, just to stay safe. Shadow Mist, what's up from Newark, Delaware? What? That's awesome. Where in Newark? Are you close to like the Christiana Mall or like where, what's the closest? Landmark by you. That's where we're originally from. That's where we're originally from, yep. Ultima said Ultima. 31 kilograms is 68 pounds. 68 pounds, so that's what this weighs total. Is that what I said it weighed, 31 yeah, kilograms? That's it's, about, it's it about right. It's about right. It's about right. Yeah, it's about right. And then without the battery, it'll be a little bit lighter, but still, it's pretty freaking light. Tubeless tires, dude. Freaking suspension, front fork suspension. The freaking suspension in the rear. Thing is crazy. <laughs> yeah, the lights on the, I like the back light too. Does, that, does anybody uh, want, me to, want me to take off on it again? Yeah. Any new guys? <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, I'm gonna knock over the tree. Peace out. <laughs> I'm trying not to skid in the house so D won't kill me. <laughs> That's crazy. Here's full throttle. <laughs> That's full throttle. Not in charge of battery, it's not fully charged. You can, Someone said this bike weighs 53 pounds. The throttle actually feels pretty smooth, like it's not like jumpy or anything. So like, bike's 53 pounds, battery's 7 pounds, and carries 330 pounds. Okay. That is awesome, guys. Joe, so the, Joe said, I'll send you a pair of deer horns to snag on the front. Bro, that would be so freaking funny, <laughs> like... God, that'd be sick, dude. <laughs> Watch out, get out of my way. <laughs> so you can still turn off the light and go. Todd said, very well thought out design for sure. David, you could bring that into work and park it under your desk. <laughs> yeah, Yo, you can. You totally can. Charge it right under your desk, guys. That's sick. I see Connecticut. I just bought a motion activated rear tail light. Looks uh, like that would be a good swap yeah. for that rear reflector. Let me show you. I actually have one of those, and I always keep it on my book bag. Why? Because it, it goes everywhere with you. And that way, if you're on like a bike like the Suron, that stock doesn't have like those um, a working brake light. It just stays red the whole time. You bring this with you. And I do have an Amazon link down below for this light, too. I have an Amazon store. And, then, and it senses when you're, when you're stopped, and then once you stop, start moving, it's probably not going to work now because it's whatever. But yeah, this is one of those brake sensing lights, and they're awesome. I love it. That's also the rider bag for you guys? You also have yeah, the rider bag? I do have a link down below. Um, dude, 
Do you guys want to do like a live where I show you what's in my book bag? Because I, I always, always have people like, yo, what do you carry in your book bag? Like, what do you do if something happens? Like, what's in your book bag? Um, would you guys want me to do a live stream one day where I just like rip through my book bag and show you guys everything I use? Or should I just make it a video? I think it's more fun, uh, more engaging uh, doing things live and talking to you guys and being able to answer the questions like right in front of you guys. But I can definitely go through this and show, show you guys like kind of all the stuff that I carry. Joe OSW said if you wanted to, you could get an extra battery for extended ride. Heck yeah, dude. And there's, it's such a light battery that I wouldn't mind carrying a second one in my book bag or whatever, or maybe even strapping it to the back right there. Cause you, know, you could probably just lay it down and strap it just like that and swap them out whenever you need to. That would be kind of cool. Or I wonder if you can find another battery that actually plugs in like this. Um, then you just swap that, kind of cool too. So there's definitely some cool customization that you can do on this bike, I'm stoked on it. Then they have a, uh, another color too, I think it's like a gray or a black, like a, maybe a light gray or something. I kind of like this white one. I do, I, I like it too, yeah, it's the pretty neat. The white. I can't believe it's got freaking tubeless tires and all that suspension on it. I'm gonna go try to wheelie this thing soon. Do we have any more uh, comments you wanna catch up to everything? Brian McCann, leave the tree up all year. <laughs> Philip uh, Rayford, when you get as much free stuff as Mr. McSkate, it's always Christmas. Yeah, every day is Christmas. And like I said, we got, we got some fun uh, things to unbox for the Suron coming soon. Some very big, big, huge, huge upgrades coming for the Suron. I can't wait to show you guys what we got. And you have a giveaway coming soon. Got a giveaway coming. It's like uh, Suron Canada sent me some like merch and stuff to, to give away, which was really awesome of them. Oh, it's still this on. Said, oh my God, it almost took off. Why'd I do this that? This said, give it to Bomber Marv. I think he can make some mini magic. Oh my God, imagine if Bomber Marv just like goes like that. This bike's going to go like 90 miles an hour. Like you guys know he is the e-bike wizard and everything he touches turns into gold and it goes really fast. It's, it's just crazy. Brian McCann said, EUC, where is it? Bro, I still haven't seen Mr. E, but... Um, I will be seeing him hopefully here very soon, or if not, maybe I'll see him at one of these uh, mega rides coming up. But I still have the scooter that I'm swapping out for, for the uh, King Song 16X or S. Maybe it's X. I think it's X or S. I don't know. <laughs> you tell me. Bulletproof bike. Oh, here it is. Sorry. Found a conversion kit. Um for it on Amazon for $420 and it's a 1,000 watt. For this? Seriously? Can you send me the link to that? Yeah, send me the link and we'll put it under this video. Yeah, that's crazy. Dude, maybe I should make that a video, do the review and then buy that kit and freaking do a little review upgrading it and then uh, send it back on to Amazon. <laughs> That's Super so tiny crazy. bike looks great, but I'm telling you, when Mini Mike spouts out, you stole her e-bike. <laughs> Super tiny, this is super tiny. <laughs> Mini Mark Mouth. Huck, guys, I'm a big truck driving driver. I have one and use it to go where big trucks can't go. And with it folded, she sits on my passenger seat. Fun, fun, fun. What, really? Seriously? That's badass. I love that, man. That's cool as hell. Yeah, that's nice. That's just so cool that you can pull something out of a vehicle like this and then just go exploring for miles and miles. Uh, so Joe cool. said because the tires are small, you have better rolling resistance for hills. Mm. I'm, I'm excited to see the, the climbing on this, just to see. I don't, I don't think it's going to climb anything too crazy, but 19 miles an hour for something this small ain't too bad. But damn, if we throw a 1,000 watt motor, change out that controller right quick. I'm not sure if you have to change out any of like, like the harness or anything in there for uh, more power or not. Maybe it comes with the harness, that kit. Philly in the building said, my birthday is February 19th. Dude, we're a day apart? That's crazy. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm like a day apart from Chris, I think. Mm-hmm. Shaw. New Chris Shaw that comes at you guys. Maybe we'll throw some axes for my birthday. I love throwing axes. Shadow Mist. I met a guy who had a bike that size. He said he absolutely loves it better than his other one. Seriously? It's about 25 to 28 miles an hour. Damn, he's got he's got a fast one then. It's just, yeah, it's cool. You can probably get into so many places that even bigger bikes can't get in. <laughs> it's gonna be sick, dude. 
Super tiny. The rental scooters are fun. I'd love to try one. Dude, they should do like a rental with these. How cool would that be? Yeah, cool. have you guys tried the um, scooters with the seats? Shreddy did a video on that. It was funny. There's like a lot of, there's like grease. Oh, maybe Ride that's from the chain. I have a smaller e-bike for yeah. MC Watt 2. Fun, but the range is not great. Nowhere near claimed range. Which one do you have, Ryan? He, he said a, he has a 350 watt e-bike too? Yeah. So usually, like, whatever they tell you in range, they're probably telling you on, like, the lowest mode, or I don't think you even change the mode on this. Like, I don't even know what, if it has pedal assist or how that works, I should tell you the truth. I don't know if this has pedal assist. It might not. Huh? Actually, Guess here we'll we go. see. <laughs> no, so no pedal assist. I, yeah, because I don't see, like, well, actually, no, there's a, there's a wire going down to the pedals. How? Do you guys know how to put it to the, like, pedal assist? Because it does, see this wire going down to the pedals? Usually that's kind of like for the cadence sensor. Yeah, there's definitely a sensor there. Do you think there's an app for this bike? Or something? It's got to have pedal assist. I didn't know if like you hit the throttle and then start pedaling, it kind of kicks it in or it doesn't feel like it. Wait a minute, I think it was. I hear it. Yep, okay. You hear it running, D? Yeah. So it doesn't even have, look, okay, I'm like learning about this bike as I play with it in front of you guys. So it doesn't even have like different levels of pedal assist, it's just throttle, or if you do want pedal assist, you start off with the throttle and then let go of the throttle and start pedaling. And it seems like it's like a really low pedal assist. But we're gonna see what this thing's all about. So there's not too much, there's not like a, a, a display, doesn't tell you too much on it. Just tells you like a little battery bar. But I wonder if you can upgrade and get different displays for this. It's pretty neat, it does have an ignition. That's kind of cool. Key for the battery too, different key. So get two sets of keys, that's the only thing I wish it was just one key for everything. Questions, questions? Loon said I'll be in New York the day before the mega ride. We'll have to talk to you about hotels later. Not sure where you're gonna stay. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't even know yet. I'm still trying to figure out too, like what hotel to stay at for the um, Florida mega ride and get that all planned out. You guys, I have a question. So Tampa. Are Surons legal in New York or can they get smashed? Cause I do worry about him going to New York if a Suron can get smashed. They are smashing Surons in places. Unfortunately, and our bikes and four wheelers. Building the building, when is the New York Mega Ride? Ooh, June. Was it June or July, D? I think it's uh, the third week in June. And then the Florida Mega Ride is the first week in March. March, yep. March 1st to the 3rd? Or 3rd through the... Something like that. Something Second, like that, yeah. I think... I'll, I'll post everything. Once I get a flyer for that, I'll, I'll throw it up on Instagram. Brian McCann said, I want to guess Tuk Tuk Rick Shaw. Rickshaw. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> Wait, didn't you write that another time on here? I think he did. A gas tuck tuck rickshaw. It sounds like a it really does. dirty word. Tuck tuck rickshaw. Sounds like a, like a funny country song. I'm getting that gas gas tuck tuck rickshaw. Super Tiny said it's a cartoon. <laughs> Brian McCann said doesn't fold not hold. Oh, yours, Brian? Oh, so it just stays wide. This one folded good. This, crazy how it folds. Do you guys, anybody new to the chat want to see me fold this thing down? And, See how small it gets. Uh, Joe OSW, I always pay the 50% premium and get the higher quality name brand battery. Yeah, so like with batteries too, like I, I was reading somewhere like you, it, if it's a good battery, it'll, it'll have something like it's certified, like CL or something on that, somewhere along those lines. But I don't see that certification on this battery. Looks like it was going to be like a 20 amp hour battery, but when you pull it out, it's so much lighter. So I think you could probably get upgraded batteries for this, for sure. Like a 20, 48 volt, 20 amp hour batteries. The Moto, I would bet it's a really tiny speed controller that is no more than 15 amps. 15 amp, yeah. Joe Dude. OSW, my truck tires cost 500 each. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> Brian Flores, hey, what's up, Shreddy? What's going, sorry, I'm like thinking tires and, what's going on, Brian? How you doing, brother? Thanks for joining the stream. I'm like zoning out, like, hold on, wait. 
Super Tiny said, I wish we had a better immobility scene in the UK. It's all kind of illegal. You have to stay under the radar. I hope that changes for you guys. That's so upsetting. Like, I think, like, they're only limited to, like, 15 miles an hour. Like, can't have throttle. It has to be just pedal assist. Stuff like that. Like, the uh, uh, Super 73 bikes that came out there, they're actually li limited to 20. No throttle, but they had better components, like better brakes. They, it came with a 10 speed and we didn't have, I don't know, it's, it's crazy, it's crazy. Brian Flores said, nice looking bike, looks cool. Yeah, isn't it crazy? I, I, I didn't think I was gonna be so hyped on this thing, but I, I totally am, I'm pretty hyped on this thing. It's, it's gonna be a lot of fun, I can't wait. And if you guys are interested in uh, supporting the channel or just helping the channel grow, I do have a link down there for the Angway T14 from Amazon. Um, and if you guys aren't interested in, in this bike, check out all those other links down below because there might be a bike you like. I have a lot of other bikes on the channel and links for them also. So, and accessories and batteries. If you guys want upgraded batteries, uh, Chai Battery Systems, best battery company around, the greatest customer service you could ever have. Check them out. I got a link down below. They have batteries for Suron. They got batteries for Onyx Super 73, one wheels, Talaria Sting just came out and it's called the Titan. If you guys want to save 5% off those batteries, use code SHREDDY. Richard Santiago said, I should have gotten this instead of the Aventon Solterra. The Aventon So I'll have to look that one up. Well, that's a mini one? Um, uh, yeah, I guess uh, Aventon makes a mini, a mini bike too, huh? I'm going to have to check it out. To ride two people, one sits on the seat in the front and the passenger rides standing on the seat in the back holding the rider's shoulder. <laughs> Dude. Joe yeah, it'll work. if you're gonna be in the city, it's a great bike because it's extremely maneuverable, small tires and short wheelbase. Yeah. And good for apartments. And... I don't condone riding on sidewalks, but this is a bike that you could probably ride on sidewalks. Brian McCann said, winter, weed hunger adds the pounds. <laughs> True that. Mike Warren, 25 amp controller, no doubt. You think? I feel like if it had something like a 30 or 40, let's get it. <laughs> oh, Shadow said he's near Beck's Pond. Yeah, we used to live by Christiana Mall. Yeah. Des I used to go to Beck's Pond a lot it's fishing. It's about the same size as my last 125 mini bike. This thing is crazy, bro. That's awesome. I love mini bikes and I've always liked them. That's probably why I'm so hyped on this. It's like, you know, like the Coleman mini bikes and stuff like that. Add the green slime ASAP would look sick with a paint job. Oh, you think, uh, so green slime would work with this. Okay, yeah, yeah. I've got uh, armadillos that I use on this, on uh, like my one wheel and I put armadillos in my Super 73 and actually worked. I got a freaking nail in it and it worked. I have Scoot Connecticut said I have the same rider bag but in bright green. Oh yeah, I got the I got the bright green one upstairs. That was my first one, but when he said they had the, the black one coming out, I was like, heck yeah, send me that one. That thing looks sick. And you have a discount code for rider bags. Uh, right? I think it's code Shreddy10 for 10% off. I think or yeah. Shreddy10 for 10% off. What's cool about <laughs> I crashed hard on this on this on this uh with this book bag and I had my spine protector in. Luckily, it's got a spine protector. When I got hit by the Grinch and he, his bike snapped in half and he rocked me hard. Luckily, I had this book bag on. I landed on it with a bunch of jackets in it, my spine protector. I didn't get hurt at all except for my, my elbow hit the ground, and I think I chipped bone, and that hurt for, for almost a whole year. And then I got really bad whiplash. Um, that freaking sucked. But other than that, if I didn't have this bag on full of stuff with the spine protector, I think I would have been hurting. I'm and sure I, you guys have all seen that video of the Grinch crash. Yeah, the Grinch crash. You guys should check that out. <laughs> I'll be posting up another, uh, what do you call them on you know, YouTube shorts? On Once uh, February pops up. Dumb auto, if you do the book bag thing live, we can tell you all the things you were doing wrong. Yeah, and tell me like what I need. Be like, all right, so that's not good. We'll get you better, that, or this and that. It looks like it has like two connection points up there. Maybe for like We should make him do bottle. a toolkit thing live so we can tell him what he needs. Right, here's all my tools. <laughs> Literally in a bag, that's it. I got a bag of tools and... Uh, <laughs> Matt said, I'd love to pick it up and make it a fun town, in-town ripper. Dude, this thing is crazy. You could add a mid-motor to that, get reflective stickers and put them on the rear side. Dude, there's so much. David Cook, I really want to stir on Ultra B. Dude, me too, bro. Me too. If you guys, um, I do have a link for $50 off to stir on Ultra B from Built 
e-bikes. I'm not sure if we threw the link down here, yes. but if you do click that link down below and you want to pre-order it, uh, you'll get $50 off your order. I know it's not crazy, uh, a lot of, to save, but still 50 bucks off your order, an accessory you can buy, or, you know. And then you have the discount links if they want to upgrade their Suron Yep, too. if you want to get the Chai battery, like I said earlier, uh, for the Suron, a uh, Gladiator battery, you can use code SHREDDY, say 5%. That's how much? It was like over 100 bucks or 200 close to 200 off or something like that. Yeah, for the Chai battery, yep. And then they do have batteries for Super 73s, Onyx, and One Wheels. Uh, Roz said, please review Leaf Living AK AKEZ 60 volt 20H dirt bike. Okay, I haven't seen that one yet, but if I can get my hands on one, definitely. And I'll, I will be getting um, uh, electric dirt bike this summer from a company called Wired. I'm going to be uh, reviewing that and then I got to send it back once I'm done with that, but I'm excited to try that thing out. No, not Miles and Miles try six tops. Remember to unlock it. Um, okay. Yeah. I got to remember that. Unlock. Ross, send him a link for that Leafling um, dirt bike. Yeah. And, and whoever had that little unlock thing, I can't remember what you said, but just can you send me a message on how to unlock this bike in case it is locked down to like 10 miles an hour or whatever. Hopefully I can hit 19 on this thing. This thing's crazy. I'm so excited about it. Does have you seen the mini electric bike conversion Saronster does? It's yeah. It's in the Engway, but does, does around 50 mile an hour plus. Those look dope. And his little freaking wheelchair he had, that thing was sick. <laughs> the mobility wheelchair freaking rocked. I think it's crazy. You know what I really want? I've always wanted a recumbent bike with uh, the four four wheel recumbent bikes, four hub motors, all freaking um, treaded tires, take them out on sand dunes. Imagine that, how fun would that be? Matt said, take the bike outside and test it. I will, I'll be testing it. I, I'm not gonna do it on the stream. Every time I, I usually do tests on the bikes on the stream, everybody starts leaving because the quality isn't good. Yeah. We'll be testing it in the next video, guys. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be doing a video here soon. We'll be testing it, riding it like this. I'll raise it and ride it like that. I'll try to do some wheelies on this. Maybe we'll hit some jumps. Yeah, Brian McCann said, NYC is smashing Surons now. Connecticut is smashing ATVs and dirt bikes. Wow. That's sad. UK is crushing Surons too. Oh That's my God. just insane. It's so stupid. It's like a waste, dude. Building the building, I would go and bring my C3. C3 Strom, hell yeah. That, um, if you guys um, didn't catch that video of the Christmas parade, I did get to ride Philly in the building C3 Strom. So you guys should check that out. That bike was fun to ride. Pretty solid. Dumb Water said, nobody in New York community has had their Surons taken by the NYPD so far. Only They've only taken gas-powered stuff. What are the videos we keep seeing of them crushing? I, I swear I see Surons. UK. Oh, that's the UK where they're crushing them? Jeez, Super Tiny, man. love the channel. Hope to visit sometime soon. Thank you, brother. Where are you at, Super Tiny? Are you in Florida? Or Cali? Enforcer said how people walk and run in the e-bike lane, so why can't we ride on the sidewalk? Right. I, know. I, I love riding on the sidewalk. I see, like, the guy, like, New York, bro. That's, like, the worst. Like, when people ride on the bike lanes in New York, like, it seems like they hate life because there's cars parked there, people walk in, cars drive. Like, it's just a mess there. Super Tiny said, Central Suspension was a dream of MotoGP back in the day. So good to see it again. That's so crazy. I, I, I want to see like a bigger e-bike, like something like this with something like that. Like how, and I don't know, man. That seems like it would be a, a little weak point, you know, for something bigger if you plan on jumping it. But we'll see. Can we jump this thing? Can I wheelie it? Who knows? Rear brake is on the left. That's Brian, Brian McCann said, do you do church? To do YouTube shorts, eating food, shopping for candy sticks, meeting up with D, <laughs> do some skits, how to meet a woman on an e-bike, safety tip with, shorts. With this bike. Like, yo, what's up, girl? <laughs> you want to hop on the back? You want to you go for a ride? Uh, is Ismail Ramos, what's up, Taino Boricua? Any chance you can review the upcoming Ride 1 Up Rev 1? Do you the, have that? <laughs> no, I have the Ride 1 Up Core 5. But I was just thinking, to double somebody, I could pedal here, the person you're doubling could sit here, and then we could ride like this, and they could just kind of hold on like that, and then maybe put their feet like that. Uh, Isabel, we can look into the uh, Ride 1 Up Rev 1. Yeah, for sure. we can get it on the channel. What do you like about that bike? What, what do you think, uh, what's making you want to check that bike out? 
Joe OSW, check out Utah Trikes. They have tadpole freewheel that you could throw a mid motor on. Ooh, that sounds fun. I, I want a trike so bad, but man, that's gonna take up so much room. <laughs> Super tiny said Bristol, UK. Wow. What time is it there now? Like one 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 a.m. Like three p.m. or something. I mean three a.m. I don't know. No, he said a uh, half past midnight in the UK, right? That was like a half hour ago. Guys, thank you guys for joining the stream. We're gonna cut it right here. This was a lot of fun. I always love doing these live streams with you guys and definitely stay tuned. I'm gonna be unboxing all the fun upgrades we're gonna do on the Suron very soon. And if you guys have questions about any of the upgrades, where to get them, how to install them, I'll be there to help you and uh, talk you guys through all that stuff. Um, cannot wait for these upgrades. It's gonna be a totally, totally brand new Suron. And again, if you guys wanna support this channel, you guys are interested in the Engway T14, check out that link down below from the Amazon a store. I think you can get it for about $4.99 from Amazon. Everywhere else, it's a couple hundred bucks more. Um, if this bike isn't for you, check out all those other links down below. There might be a bike you like. Any more last questions before you go, before we go? If you guys enjoyed that content, please consider subscribing, hitting that like button, and ringing that notification to be notified when I'm making videos. And are you guys ready for the moment of silence for the subscribe button? If you guys aren't subscribed, in three, two, one, hit subscribe, heads down. All right guys, I'll see you in the next live unboxing. Thank you guys. Say bye, Dee Dee. Bye guys.